Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy Noah back again with another video. Back at it with the avocado shirt. This is my favorite shirt. How can you just not love avocados? You know what I mean? Um Happy to be here with you guys. If you're new to my channel, my name is Noah. I help people awaken to their true abilities through wellness and spirituality. And I wanted to come on here and um, bring you today's video today. Um, I kind of had a, um, had felt called to uh, do this video. And I just want to talk about the game of life, pretty much. Now, what is the game of life? Uh, you know, in my opinion, I feel like we shouldn't really take, um, life super serious. You know, we're all on this earth for a certain divine purpose. And I believe that we're all interconnected. Um, I feel like we're not only connected with every human on this earth, but we're also connected to everything, you know, every plant, every animal everything on this plane, on this earth plane, we are connected to. Um, I believe that. And, um, and so I think that it's important to not take life so serious because when we do, then we can get caught up in like, you know, different stressful situations that we might find ourselves in. Um, you know, uh, when we come here, we kind of forget who we are um, you know, as we're born into conditioning through our parents or maybe our friends, um, we kind of forget who we are and then we, you know, forgetting who we are is, oh, is the whole part of, um, the, um, mission, you know what I mean? If we didn't forget who we are, then, um, there would be no lesson to be learned, you know, and, um, we couldn't enjoy life to the fullest, you know what I mean? Um, in order to, you know, be very grateful, we have to understand that, you know, we have to understand why we're here, you know? Um, and so I think it's important to, to realize that, you know, we can, it's easy for us to be caught up in what we can, you know, go against or what we can hate on, you know, we can hate on the system or we can hate in, on the government, this or that. But, you know, in reality, this is all part of the mission, you know, um, it's all part of our existence. You know, if that stuff didn't exist, then, you know, life wouldn't be so, um, we wouldn't have things to be grateful for, you know what I mean? So I think it's important to realize that, you know, yeah, we forget who we are and stuff like that through conditioning. And I think we can either go take two paths. We can either, you know, hate the government for the things that we've done, you know, and this is something that I'm still working on myself. But, um, we can choose to hate the government and, um, you know, blame them for everything that's going on. You know, um, we could say, why did they only give us $1,200? You know what I mean? Um, um, or we could go down the other path, which is, you know, that we're grateful that to even receive any money from the government. You know what I mean? Um, they couldn't, there could be a possibility that they don't really have to give us any money. You know what I mean? Um, they're choosing to give us money, you know what I mean? So, um, and same with the whole game of life, you know what I mean? We can either choose to be grateful for being here, you know what I mean? Or we can also choose to, um, be, uh, we can also choose to you know, despise the world and, um, be dissatisfied with our situation, you know? Um, and I think it's easy for us to get caught up in, 
in certain situations that we feel like is serious, but in reality, it's not really that serious considering um, that there are people who don't even have access to this video, you know what I mean? There are people without roofs over their heads, um, and there are people who just don't really have, um, they have like nothing compared to what we have, you know? So, I think it's important to um, be grateful and to just realize, you know, yeah, we forget who we are, but altogether, that's the plan, you know what I mean? We, we forget who we are in order to remember so that we can live life to the fullest, you know? Um, and so, I kind of just wanted to come on here to just say, don't take life too serious and um, try to be grateful, you know, um, practice gratitude. It'll really be a, a tool to help you manifest whatever you desire. It'll also be a tool to just be happy. You know what I mean? I tweeted out a few years ago, uh, and I don't really tweet anything at all, but before I had my spiritual awakening, you know what I mean? I tweeted out um, that gratitude is the number one key to happiness. You know what I mean? And I stand by that. I think that if you're grateful then it's hard not to be happy, you know what I mean? Just ultimately because you see, you're able to, you're able to just realize how many things that you have instead of focusing on the things that you don't have, you know what I mean? And that's when, that's when life becomes amazing, you know? And that's when you ultimately begin to experience heaven on earth, you know, when you're consistently, when you consistently are grateful you know, um, I think that heaven does exist and I think that it exists on this earth. We just have to tap into that ourselves, you know, um, through following our heart and doing what we desire, you know. So with that being said, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for tuning into this short little video. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to let me know in the comment section down below. Or if you just want to say hi, I reply to every comment. So. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Have a wonderful afternoon, morning, or night, wherever you're at. And peace, love, and happiness.